Hello dear students, welcome to Devika's Commerce and Management Academy. Mode calculations, today we will see continuous series, quite easy. If you are thorough till discrete series, individual is quite easy, so there is nothing to worry. Discrete series if you follow, generally we can trace out if the frequency difference is lot, then we can trace out easily. Otherwise, if next number, next highest number is nearer to the highest number, then we have to go for grouping analysis table. Through grouping analysis table, we can find out the mode. Sometimes through grouping analysis table also, if you are unable to find out, then it is a bimodal method. In bimodal method, we use the formula, different formula, 3 median minus 2 mean, as we have done in the last class. The same thing is applicable here also, but today, continuous series will work out simple problem. Okay? So, the formula you have to remember in continuous series. What is the formula? Simple formula, remember, Z means mode. Mode is equal to L plus D1 by D1 plus D2 into I. L plus D1 by D1 plus D2 into I. So, this is the formula. Sometimes people use this one also. When I was student, I have studied this formula only. Z is equal to L plus delta 1 by delta 1 plus delta 2 into I. Into I. Z is equal to L plus delta 1 by delta 1 plus delta 2 into I. Even when I wake up in the early morning also, I would be able to answer this. I would be able to recollect this formula. I was so thorough in all the formulas. So, mode is equal to L1 plus delta 1 by delta 1 plus delta 2 into I. Or otherwise, D1, L1, L plus D1 plus D1 plus D2 into I. Any formula you can use it. Check out your test book. If you are finding this one, follow this. If, you, if it is there, you can follow. Anyway, methodology is same. See the problem. From the following data, find mode. Data is given like this. Class interval. This is continuous series, right? X, class interval, frequency also given. If you see the frequency, highest frequency is 48. Next to highest is 36, 34. There is a lot of difference. If it is somewhere like 46, 47 or 45 also, we could have gone for grouping analysis table. When you find difference a lot, next number to highest number, then you can write one sentence. By inspection, mode lies in. Okay? So, I will write here. By inspection, mode lies in class which one this is the highest so it lies in 90 to 110 one sentence you have to write by inspection means by estimation so mode lies in class 90 to 110 then write the formula what is the formula you know that i have written I have written Z is equal to L plus L plus D1 by D1 plus D2 into I. Here L means 90. L is 90. Next, what is the D1 value? D1 is 48 minus 34. Okay? 48 minus 34. Uh, 48 minus 34 means how much it comes? 48 minus 34, 14, right? So, 14, I will write it in the brackets, 38 minus, sorry, 48 minus 34. In the same way, D2, D, D2 is 48 minus 32, okay? 48 minus 32, you will get 16. How do you got 16? 48 minus 32. No confusion at all. This, you know, middle number is this one. By inspection mode lies here. From 48 to 32, if you deduct, you will get D1. From 48 to 32, if you deduct like this, you will get D2. Getting? D1 is 48 minus 34. 
d2 is 48 minus 32, 48 minus 34 d1, 48 minus 32 d2 or delta 1 or delta 2, delta 1, delta 2 anything. Okay? Now, we know these values i is class interval, i is how much? 20, i is equal to class interval 20, apply it in the formula. Z is equal to I is here, L, L is 90, lower class interval always we have to take or otherwise you can write here L is 20, 90 plus D1 is 14 by 14 plus 16 into I, I is 20, calculate it, over that is it. See 14 into 20, 14 into 20 comes to 280, 90 plus 280 by 16 into 14, 30, 280 divided by 30 comes to 9.33, means 90 plus 9.33. So, it is 99.33 is the mode. Clear? Shall I explain once again? So, this is the problem given to us. We know that uh, 48 is the highest. Next highest number is 34. When you find there is a lot of difference between the highest number to next to highest, we can write one sentence. By inspection mode lies in class 90 to 100. Write the formula. Z is equal to L1 plus L, L, L or N, L1 you can say. L plus D1 by D1 plus D2 into I. So, here D1 means 48 minus 34. D2 is 48 minus 32. L is we know 90. I is here class interval. So, applied in the formula we got 99.33, got it? If you understand there is a homework for you. So, this is the homework problem. Here x is not given, mid value is given. You have to find out the x. Same pattern we have done already somewhere in median or arithmetic means somewhere we have done. You know how to calculate anyway, I will explain it once again, frequency is given. When problem is given with mid value, we have to find out the x. How to find out the x? Difference between any number is 5, 5, make it half, 2.5. Difference is 5, make it half, half means that is 2.5, okay. 2.5 if you deduct from 5, you will get lower class interval. That is if you deduct 5 minus 2.5 lower class interval. If you add 2.5 to this phi means 7.5, this is upper class interval. In the same way, if you deduct 2.5 means 7.5, if you add 17.5, okay. In the same way, here if you deduct 12.5, Yes, 12.5. If you add, no? so, so here, uh, sorry, I have added here, I think. We have to focus on mid value. If you minus 2.5, if you add 7.5, if you deduct 7.5, if you add 12.5, it is. My focus gone for 15. Anyway, if here if you deduct 12.5, and add 17.5. Here if you add, deduct 17.5, if you add 22.5 and here 22.5 and 27.5, this is 27.5, if you add 32.5. So like x you have to find out, frequency is any way you know. If you see the frequency, uh, this is the highest one. You can write same like this problem, by inspection mode lies in class interval 17.5 to 22.5. Apply the formula, same like this. Your answers, answer must be 18.75.
clear? Take a screenshot. Let me know how many of you are getting the same answer. This calculation also just I have told you, you do it by yourself. Note down only this problem and work out your answer must be here. Let me know in the comment box if you are getting the correct answer. I feel very happy you are working homework also just like normal class. Though I am teaching you online but you are in front of me. So work out and focus, practice well, check out the playlist, whatever is useful, use it and practice more. Don't forget to share these videos because everything is free of cost. So see you in the next class, till that period practice well. Good luck.